four muscles combine, and form squadriceps muscle. First one is vastus medialis muscle. Second is vastus lateralis. Third is rectus femoris. Fourth is vastus intermedius, lies behind the rectus femoris muscle. The work of quadriceps muscle is, to extend the knee joint. The vastus medialis muscle, is part of anterior compartment of thigh, and located, in medial side of thigh. The vastus medialis muscle originated, from intertocanterocline of the femur, then muscle continues down, and backside descends, along with medial lip of linea aspera, and medial supracondylar, line of the femur. The muscle inserted in base and medial border of patella. According to the position of muscle fibers, vastus medialis muscle, divide into two parts. Upper fibers is long, and inline fibers. So it is called vastus medialis lungus. VML And direction of lower fibers is horizontal or oblique. So it's called vastus medialis oblique, VMO. This part of muscle is called VMO, function of VMO. Vastus medialis oblique muscle extend, the knee joint. And its work is kneecap, as it stabilize the patella. In which condition VMO, gets weak. Post-operative condition like any surgery in knee joint for bone fracture, ligament reconstructive surgery or, joint replacement surgery. In non-operative condition like osteoarthritis of knee joint. Now, some exercises for VMO muscle. In open chain exercises. First one is last degree of knee extension. Patient position is long sitting or supine lying. Put towel roll below knee joint. Then ask patient to extend the knee joint and hold that position for 5 second. Then back to starting position. Second exercise is, straight leg raising SLR. Patient in supine position, then ask to patient lift his leg up to 40 degree, hold that position for 5 second, and get back to starting position. Third exercise is high sitting knee extension in that, all four cataraceps muscle get into work. Patient position is high sitting. Then ask patient to do knee extension. Hold that position for 5 to 10 second A and get back to normal position. In closed chain exercises. First one is squatting. Ask patient to stand with wall supported, with leg apart. Then patient bend his hip and knees. At that time, the back of patient is supported with wall and get back to normal position. Second exercise with TheraBand. The patient is in standing position. Therapist place the TheraBand at patient's knee, then ask patient to push a knee backside, against the resistance. Hold that position for 5 seconds and then relax. Studies shows that closed chain exercises is effective, then open chain exercises.